Monk is still afflicted by the the curse of the bells, and Bell does not have enough power, even with a legendary sword. What are we gonna do? Not help the sociopath. We're gonna donate some money. <laughs> like any any person, I suppose. Yeah, I'm give sure give money to the psychopath and just kill the man. That sounds reasonable. You, you're gonna buy your safety, right? You're buying your safety. Right. I know it, right, Julie. So the charge team doesn't know where to go, even though. I guess we're just gonna assume that Monk can hang on for a few more, a few more days. So, you have to pay for every train ticket. Well, uh, you pay for there and back. Yep, and there, there's a one-time use thing for him, but it's not that bad. How do you make money? It's, uh, well, you, oh, did you see that when we kissed the the clam? She gave us five hundred bucks. Oh, I didn't notice. Yep. That's the primary source of money for right now. It won't always be, but... That, that and dumpster, dumpster diving. Yeah, yeah, that's exactly it. That's a big one, too. Well, let's talk to the policeman. The, 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 somebody. the policeman right? is fucking creepy. <laughs> he says, I'm gonna what if, fuck what you up! What, what if I told you that um, if you run into him at night, he shoots you? Aha! Uh -huh. See? I was right. Oh. You seen oh. the, those memes about the villager and Smash Brothers? Does this look like oh, the face yeah. of mercy? That, that could be it. Uh, uh, he says that um, he he arrested Goto, and he had a good time doing it, and now Goto is at the cemetery. What? Yeah, that's where they put their criminals is in the cemetery. That that that's fucking disturbing. <laughs> I I had a good time arresting him, and now he's in the cemetery. Underground. Well, he enjoyed it. And the policeman did, and she didn't know where she where he went. And now, surprisingly enough, this charge him when he tried to help Monk. He's out. He's also these events are unfolding in front of him. Oh no! Hmm. Aw, Julie. She hit you with a bottle! Yeah, but... Tokom syndrome. You know, love is... It makes people... Oh, man. She what? She already. She just said she was gonna commit suicide? No, no, he wants to commit a crime. Oh, he wants to commit a crime. Okay, okay. Yeah, yeah. So I... she can get arrested, too. Which is a hint. And now, how do we tell Mel? So, your dad got arrested. And we were kind of there. And it's Sorry. because we asked for wine. Yeah. And if we didn't ask for wine, things would be fine. And the only reason why we asked for wine is because... Y yeah, we your life was fucked up, we just made it worse. <laughs> yeah, Charge Team has got his fingers all over the place right now, let me tell you that. And so he's gonna go to the... Death sound disturbing. Definitely. Again. Yeah, what would he... Yeah, you missed out on the graveyard stuff. There's a, there's a bunch of... That was a big puzzle. But Monk is still... Still hasn't been... Oh, I think Charchim was checking the gravestone to see if that was Goto. Who has a last name, but I don't know if everyone knows it yet. We need more power. Where do you suppose you find power, Adriano? Uh, batteries? <laughs> yeah, let's go to the convenience store and buy some triple A's. There you go. Maybe it's the crane feather. We should have time right now. Cause Mel uh, Monk looks really sick. Jeez. And plus, they have like ghost bells all over the place. Oh, you're gonna go get charcoal. Yeah, that's exactly right. Actually, that's where he, he Charcoal doesn't know nowhere else to go. So he's he remembers seeing that there is charcoal. Actually, I don't know if he consciously does, but he has seen that there's charcoal over there somehow. He feels compelled by like someone's puppeteering all his movements to do it. <laughs> Charchim's got his own free will, let me tell you that. And so he's gonna go get. Oh, no, no, there's nothing over here. But now it's glowing. The fuck? <laughs> bean bean! And it's charcoal. Do we want. Yeah, we do. Oh man. Oh man. Oh. Charchim's all up for it though. Pain. All right, so this. Oh, remember that. Okay. 
Hmm, yeah, it's true. Pain. Alright. So this is a mini game. It is a... I uh, don't really know the exact word for it, but it's yeah, basically right. a quick time event before yeah. a quick time event became a thing. <laughs> so it's Bane, a, so here it comes. Kung this Fu is also pose. Sweet music. I like the Kung Fu pose. Oh, there you go. Oh, did he win? Did he win? Oh, looks like it. In true anime style. He didn't even take out his backpack. Yeah, he just fucking, I don't know. Disrespectful. Yeah. Fucking disrespectful. <laughs> oh, hey, look at that. And Lily kisses, of course he does. Yeah. Tell me, is he, is he gonna kill the. Is he, is he gonna kiss the sociopath? Or the father? Right, we'll, we'll, we'll find out. Oh, well, we already kissed her dad. Monk, is, Monk has already been kissed. Okay. Monk was kissed when we gave him the the good the good gone. But Kiss Twenty Six is Charcoal, a character we never even thought existed until like what two minutes ago. And we never thought that Charchan would have to fight a battle in order to get a legendary sword. It, like beforehand, you were comparing this game to Persona, and that would be something I would expect in Persona, even though I haven't played those games, and definitely not Tulip. But here we are. Yeah, it's. I mean, Persona, you would have get, gotten a good character if you maxed out the social link. Oh yeah. Yeah, you you get a special a special character. You have to have maxed out the social link. Hmm. Interesting. And if you max out all social links, you get a special character. Interesting. But Charchams are a special character for right now. And heck, he just got himself a sword. I don't know. I, just, I, I still can't believe it. But maybe this is what more power is. Yeah. Yes, it is. Swing it with Here's... me. That sun yeah. so wrong. Here it comes. All right. Powers be ours. Oh, oh, it's working. The bells are, um, I don't know, leaving. Disappearing. Going back to where they came from. I don't know. I don't know if it's ever really explained. But they're going somewhere. From once you came, you shall remain. <laughs> yes. Hmm. Oh, it's working. Seems like it's working at least. Oh. I, I was gonna, I was gonna make a reference, but I just forgot. <laughs> oh no! But this is a. I don't know. I like this scene a lot. I think this is one of my favorite puzzles in the entire fucking game. Because I was just so, I was, I'm still amazed by it. But hey, there he is. All the bells are gone. Oh, I know what I was going to say. I thought we were going to really get charcoal and burn charcoal to get oh. power. Oh, one second. Oh, no. Oh, jeez. Oh, no. Bell is a bell. Oh, my God. What a plot twist. You hear the story? Yeah, let's hear the story. Alright. Oh no. They were called human bells. Oh jeez, that's what it was. Okay, it explained it. Explained it so. Oh no, one of them fell out. I didn't... Bell was a bell the entire time! Oh. What a twist! And, yeah. Yeah. So it turns out Bell. The entire time. So that's not his father. Oh no. It's pretty big news. Oh. Basically, you're adopted. And yeah, an alien. Basically, you're adopted and you're also not a human. Well, you're only half human, half human, half bell. But there she is. Is she gonna bang her head in a bell? Oh no. Is that, is that considered sex? <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> You, you might yeah, find out that go. I have a one-track mind. Yeah, there we go. And Charchim talked her into it, because you know what? It doesn't matter if a person's adopted or not. Biology be damned. Monk is her father. Kiss number 27 is Belle. And I think it's definitely in my top five. I think it's just fucking great. I don't care what you say. It's, it's, but but it, this explains why she's a sociopath. She's not human. Well, she's only half human. But there she is. It also explains oh. why your voice is so fucking annoying. 
<laughs> I disagree, of course, but... Way to go, Charge Him. You have saved the entire family. Not only did... It's not like a... Was... It's not like a it's father like a... never never tried to... to give him a lot of... Um, clues, because everything's around uh, about Belt around here. Yeah, yeah, it's um... It's kinda neat, though. I don't know. I just, I never I never thought there'd be one of those in here either. But you see, the thing about Shulip is that Shulip, you kind of look at the game like, oh, whatever. It's just this fucking stupid thing. It's you know, it's all it's all just supposed to be goofy or whatever. But then they actually have like some serious, like really nice character story moments like that. Because this is not there's more where that came from in terms of oh, speaking of more where that came from, what's that? It looks like for the first time we see Julia leaving the bar. And where do you suppose she's headed? Committing a crime. Oh, geez, really? <laughs> she said you wanted to. Oh, well, maybe. <laughs>